This is a KGUN 9 on your side news update. Good morning, I'm Whitney Clark. An update this morning on a deadly shooting near a hookah lounge in Midtown last month. Tucson police have arrested 22-year-old Dominic Blount in connection to that shooting near Speedway and Swan on July 27th. Officials say he arrived at a nearby hospital seeking treatment for a non-life-threatening gunshot after the incident. He's been booked into the Pima County Jail on suspicion of first-degree murder. And a suspect has been identified in the murder of Robert Ritchie. Back in June, Tucson police say the man was found dead in a backyard near Algernon and Fort Lowell with signs of trauma. As detectives continued their investigation, they were able to identify the suspect involved as 31-year-old Jeremy L. Gunderson. U.S. Marshals located Gunderson and took him into custody without incident. Gunderson was booked into the Pima County Jail on one count of second-degree murder. It's not known if it's heat related, but in Phoenix, rescue crews found an unresponsive man on a trail yesterday afternoon. He was pronounced dead at the scene. It happened at Dean Hills Recreational Park. Police are still investigating the cause of death. Now for a look outside, let's head over to Ivan Rodriguez, who's in for April this morning. Good morning, Ivan. Good morning, Whitney. Warm temperatures you can see across our region. We're going to be hitting a high of 108 degrees, and rain chances are also on their way. Let's take a quick look at your seven-day um, forecast. Like I said, we're going to be hitting 108 degrees. Our chances of rain increase by tomorrow. We're going to be hitting about 104. The weekend will be cooling off just a bit. We're going to be hitting 95, 96 for those. And by the rest of today, we should be hitting our high around 3 p.m. of 108 degrees. Whitney? News and weather updates throughout the day. You can go to our website, kegon9.com, or follow us on social media.